In this video, we're going to show you how to use the Chrome Inspector to figure out the width of your WordPress post box. What you'll see here on screen is a standard or a stock WordPress installation. I'm running a thesis theme framework, and this is set to display one featured post, which has the full post content, and then down below it, a couple of teasers. On the right side, you will see a sidebar with some recent posts, some other meta, and uh, a graphical image there. Now, this entire box here is the content box, which handles or holds both the post box, which is this, and the sidebar. And we want to know the width of our post box. So I'm running a Mac using the Chrome browser, and the hotkey or short key for the inspector is Option Command I. And that will bring up the Chrome Inspector, and this is akin to the Firefox, Firebug, and the developer tools for Internet Explorer. It allows you to explore the code of your website. I click on this little hourglass down here, this search box, and it lets me view the different segments of this website. And you can also come down here and view the different divs within this page, and I could even drill down here. I see a content box here. I see my content, which is what I'm looking for. So if I click here on content and I look on the right side, it'll tell me 63.4 EM. That doesn't really mean much to me. I might want to click down here in metrics and take a look and see what we're working with here. So you can see here that the highlighted section, which is the post box, has a width of 634 by 1248, and that's the entire content box. So maybe we could dig down even further and just look at the post box, which as you'll see, just highlights the one individual post. And that's really what we're looking for. You can see the orange elements on the side, if we look at the post box here, are the margins, 11, P pixel margin on the left side and a 23 pixel margin on the right side and the content in the middle is 600 by 690. Now the width, I'm sorry, the height we're not really concerned with because that will vary with the length of the post box itself, but the width will always be constant in this format unless we change the width inside the theme file itself. But right now what we're looking at is a width of 600 pixels. So if we wanted to have a picture that spanned the entire width of the post box, we would want that picture to be 600 pixels wide. If we wanted to set our WordPress image uploader to always be able to upload and embed a full width or a full post box width image, we would want to make sure that we give ourselves the option to do a 600 pixel picture. That's the full width in our browser. Now, if your browser were 700, pixels wide for your post box, obviously that's where you would set yours. And we're going to get into that uh, in the tutorial below this video. So this is how you use Inspector to determine the width of your post box.